Hey guys, me Jake, and in today's video, I have a review video, well, kind of like a review. I've had this helmet before, um, so I'm just going to show you what it is. It's the Shut Recruit Hybrid. I have a review on it today. Um, I got this yesterday from Sports Chalet um, at the mall. It was originally $48 with tax, and then it came down to $14, so I think it was 70% off, the guy said. Um, so let's start off with the packaging. Um, it comes like this. It says Recruit Hybrid. Powered by Energy Lock technology, um, helmet features hybrid TPU slash D30 cushioning, youth soft cushion strap, uh, Air Max TPU jaw pads, large standoff shell, I think yeah, standoff shell, and then the comfort liner, and it just shows you on the inside. On the back, this is the helmet I use for Pop Warner. It says official helmet and protective gear of Pop Warner football. So and have this little sizing thing. And then just some more about the memory film and the TPU. By the way, I think TPU stands for thermoplastic urethane. I heard this in one video. Um, so I I had this helmet before. Well, I didn't have the same exact helmet. I had um the old recruit hybrid, like where it didn't have this padding. It just had the um the foam, the TPU, and then this like white liner in it. But I honestly can say I like this a lot better. Um, it's a really cool helmet. Um. I already have the speed flex, you guys. Oh, there you should have seen the review on it already. Um, I, I just got this just for fun. Um, went to the mall, so my dad's like, "Here, you guys can each have fifty bucks. Go nuts." So, I decided to get this, and it saved me money because it's fourteen bucks. So, I guess um, I don't know how much it is in other places. Um, I just know at the mall it was forty eight, and they're having a sale on it. But, um. I had this helmet, like I said, my first season ever. Um, I played for the Oilers, so my team was all black um, uniform, so it had like the orange stripe and the O and the O on each side. Um, it's a really, really cool helmet. Um, it looks good on anyone, honestly. Um, this is a large. Um, has that little rubber bumper that says shut on it. Um, it has the shut tag right there um the face mask has nothing really new about it it's just a traditional style face mask that shut uses um i think this guy on youtube his name's isaac piano or something his brother's the franklin 60 uh youtube so he uh anyway he did a review on this old one and it said like this um and see how it's in debt like in debt right there he said it's supposed to help with shock absorption and same on the inside with this orange stuff, I'm guessing, is to help with shock absorption because, let's see, um, this is memory foam, um, the orange stuff, here I'll do a test for, see this memory foam, so, which I find memory foam is a lot better in helmets because it collects, like, it absorbs all the impact, honestly, it's really cool what they can do on a football helmet, um, I remember seeing this at Dick's, the beginning of this of last season, I'm like this is a cool helmet. Then I was, and then they had the speed. I was gonna buy this one, and then just get it painted my team colors. But then I saw the speed, um, regular speed. I'm like, all right, I'll just do that one. But yeah, um, it have, like it normally comes all shot helmets come with these, unless you don't get the TPU ones. But they usually all come with these ear pads. Another good thing about these ear pads, it's it could be a good thing or a bad thing. Um, they're not inflatable, so which means if you get hit an ear hole or whatever they won't inf deflate so you won't have to inflate them again that could be a bad thing because it only comes with one slice so if these are bad for you you can go and shut and buy bigger ones but um or smaller ones but um i know they're cheap but i'm saying if you don't want to spend a lot of money um that could be an issue um but yeah this is a fully vented helmet there's no liner in there that's re preventing you from getting airflow there's what one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's ten air holes. So you can, um, it helps you, like, not breathe, but, like, it helps you get airflow. Um, what else? Every helmet usually shut comes with TPU and this white stuff. TPU is, like, I think they use it in, like, the old World War One or Civil War helmets or whatever. Like, to absorb all the impacts. I think it was, um, World War One and World War Two. I think. Don't quote me on that, but I know what you guys are gonna you're gonna ask me probably to put it on, so I'm gonna go over there and put. 
Mind you, like I said, I just got this for fun. So one second, let me set the camera down. I'm gonna put this on. Now, I'm not gonna snap in these buckles either. So. They don't ask. Um, and by the way, I am gonna put a the red visor on this. My red visor. Um. So that's what the helmet looks like on me. It's pretty good. Um. So yeah. Uh. That's my video on the shut um hybrid football helmet. Um. In all black. If you guys have any more questions, comment down below. Um. Like I said, I'm gonna take my red visor on my speed flex and put it on here because I can't ever use that visor, so. But yeah, that's pretty much the end of the video. If you guys have any more questions, comment down below. Um, yeah, uh, so I'm probably gonna do a few more reviews tonight. I've done all the reviews I can on gloves. Well, all the gloves. I'm planning on getting the VaporJet 4s when the season starts again, up again. But, um, yeah, I've reviewed all the gloves I can. I can't, I'm not just going to review the one. So, plus there's all the, all a bunch of reviews on those. So, see you in my video. Bye. Comment, rate, comment, rate, subscribe. Bye.